Rob, Chicago police say they initially did not have a lot to work with in terms of trying to solve this case, so they believe they were able to track down this alleged murder partially with the help of a bloodhound from the Cook County Sheriff's Office. Sincere Williams walked into a Wicker Park Walgreens Sunday morning, police say, with the intention of robbing the place. Instead, investigators say it escalated to murder. He approached the victim, Olga Calderon, who was uh, just stocking shelves that Walgreens grabbed her around the neck. Uh, it appears that she tried to push away from Williams, and he began stabbing her multiple times. Police say Olga Marie Calderon's co-workers found her dead in a pool of blood inside the North Milwaukee Avenue store just before 10 Sunday morning. And this is extremely tragic to have a woman go to work and not be able to come home to her child. Police say Williams did make it home to his Old Town apartment, but not without leaving a trail of evidence behind him. We don't have any eyewitnesses to this case. And once again, we're able to charge a case working very closely with the state's attorney's office just based upon technology and the work that these officers did. They were able to track this offender from the Walgreens all the way to his residence. Investigators believe the 18-year-old robbed the same Walgreens and another one nearby, perhaps using the same knife and mask in the last few weeks. The Walgreens is still shuttered, and a small memorial to Olga Calderon memorializes the young mother who never made it home to her family. Walgreens said to us in a statement earlier tonight that they are constantly reevaluating their security practices and they're grateful to the Chicago Police Department for solving this particular crime quickly. They say this store is expected to reopen tomorrow morning. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.